Harrison County wasn't spared from the storms that hit the Arklatex on Friday. And like the rest of the area, many of you there are waiting for your power to return. KSLA News 12's Jasmine Franklin spent the day in Marshall, Texas to see how people there are handling the outages and damage. Jasmine, how are people over there doing? Right, yes, Alexandria, East Texas residents without power have been without it for six days now after those damaging storms ripped through early Friday morning. Now, as you can see across Marshall, Texas, power lines are down and the trees are uprooted from the ground. Now, across Harrison County, thousands reported power outages. Many have had their power restored. However, some residents are still without it. Appalachian Power was out working to restore power in East Texas today. One Marshall resident says over a dozen trees fell down in his yard during the storm. One of the trees totaled his wife's car. Luckily, none of the trees damaged his family's home. He says he's staying positive, standing in his backyard, surrounded by trees uprooted from the ground. We have about 21 trees down here on the property. As big as the trees were that are as close to the house as they were, that nothing hit the house yet. Yeah, we're real fortunate. We have power lines down, poles broke. I think uh, one of the linemen stopped by on Sunday and said that there's at least eight poles they have to replace before they can get to me. It's just a process. It's a, it's a mess. It's an inconvenience. Like I've told my friends across the state, it's, it really is just an inconvenience. We're staying positive. We're going to get through this. We're strong enough people to do that. It's just going to take some work. Now, Ziegler says he's been using a generator during the power outage, and he also says he's very grateful the community has been coming together and helping each other as they recover from the storm. Now, coming up tonight at 6, we'll hear more from East Texas residents recovering from this storm and still without power. If you are still experiencing power outages across the Arklatex, you can find resources on KSLA.com. In the First Alert Center, Jasmine Franklin, KSLA News 12.